Need help tracking down a person of interest after a string of attacks on the Muslim community. The front doors and windows of a mosque in Austin were shattered earlier this month. Then the tires of several cars parked outside were slashed, and now a Muslim owned food mart has been hit. KXN's Jacqueline Powell is live at APD headquarters with more on the man police are looking for. Jackie. Sydney Robert, today police released this flyer with three images on it of the same man. Now, these photos were captured from security footage at the mosque that's been hit a couple of times now. And now the store that's been hit also has footage. I think he hates the Muslims or he has some grudge against the Muslims or something. We don't know. But we worried. Hussein Syed walked me through what happened as this store became the latest target late Sunday night. These windows are fixed now, but he described what took place. He has something in his hand. He break this, and then he break this, like this. A security camera inside the store recorded it. The suspect's face isn't clear in this footage, but Syed says his shoes and possibly even his hoodie match what this man, APD's person of interest, is wearing in the photos released by police. And he says when he saw the pictures today, he recognized this man. So this is the whole story. Walking me through it, he explained he believes the same man had come in a few days earlier and made his way to the back of the store. When he left, Syed says he went into the stock room here and found rice pouring off the shelf. This bag was there, you see? They cut this bag. Just down the way in the same shopping center, the owner of this restaurant believes he was targeted too. He says several weeks back, this delivery truck of his and another employee's car had their tires slashed. As the attacks continue, Syed says Muslims in this tight-knit neighborhood are growing fearful and hoping police catch the person behind this before anything else happens. Up to now, he's damaging the property. Maybe he will start them killing the people or hurting the people. Now on this flyer, police mention a few distinguishing features. This man wears glasses. And the person of interest also has longer hair, uh, sometimes wearing it in a ponytail. So if you have any information, you're asked to either call police or Crime Stoppers. Live in Austin, Jacqueline Powell, KXAN News. All right, Jacqueline, thank you. Hate crimes have been trending upward. California State University researchers found that for the fourth year in a row, hate crimes reported by police rose in the nation's 10 largest cities. FBI data back that up. Numbers for 2017 are still being compiled, but in 2016, there was a more than 4.5% rise in hate crimes. Nearly a quarter of all religious bias hate crimes were anti-Islamic. Last year, there were 19 hate crimes in Austin. That was an almost 15% increase from the year before. And